Although it's nearly midnight, the sun is just setting. I'm on Great Bear Lake in the middle of the Northwest Territories. I paddle alongside indigenous youth from Delaney, the only community on the shores of the lake and home to the Satuotine Dene. We are on our way to a cultural camp where community members will gather out on the land to reconnect, harvest traditional foods, and discuss the future of the community and the lake. To me, this is what research looks like. The community-based participatory action research that we do focuses on climate change and food systems. Food systems are all of the people and activities involved in producing, processing, and consuming food. And in Delaney, hunting and fishing are central to both the food system and the Dene way of life. To the people of Delaney, looking after the lake as it looks after them is essential, as the health of the lake, the animals, and the people are inseparable. Of course, this is true for all people, but something that is often forgotten in today's globalized world where most people are far removed from the sources of their food. There are many challenges to creating sustainable food systems that are resilient to climate change, but for every challenge, there is a solution. And to me, connection is at the heart of it all. Building connection between communities and researchers, Indigenous and non-Indigenous people, and to the land and the water that sustain us.